Answer two, we can incentivize builders. One right. of the things that I think everybody understands is builders have been building move up homes and luxury homes because mm-hmm. it's just flat out more profitable. Right. Well, in a world where f- interest rates fall for 40 years, makes total sense. Mm-hmm. Trade up is easy. I buy the extra bedroom, the newer house, I move in, my rates down, payments up, payments, r- rates up, rates down, prices up, payments about the same. Makes perfect sense. Not going to be the case for several years to come. So we have to incentivize builders to build first-time homes. Just, mm-hmm. just have to. Right. Build, build the old 3-1, which probably hasn't been built in 20 years. Agreed. Right? That's the other one. Then you can start getting creative. One of the things that I read in Fortune Magazine the other day was an article talking about, I'm not moving. You've got to drag me out. you got to do all these things. I'm Basically, the interest rate lock-in, which I've been screaming about for a year now. What if, again, if you want to talk about how to get nutty, what if you transitioned your mortgage that you have at 2.8 to a bigger home? Because right now the math doesn't work. In fact, the math doesn't work the opposite way. In this article on Fortune, and again, I talk to Lance Lampert, Fortune editor every Thursday. Talk about baby boomers. Boomers! They got the McMansions. There's a boomer in this article, and the math is really simple. Anybody could repeat this. They want to downsize, but they can't. I mean, would you downsize for a 50% higher mortgage and have a smaller home? No, no one would. That would be dumb. (laughs) Just use less of your McMansion. Yeah, exactly. Rent out a room, lock it down, plywood it or something. Who knows, right? But that, that, so again, I go back to 1978. And again, everybody has access to this. I give away the spreadsheet for free. It's in my free course. We did 4.8 million total transactions. We don't get back to that until 1996. So wow. unfortunately, nobody wants to hear this. But the answer, as I've said for two years now, is time. Just yeah. time. We get back to affordability. With time, it sucks. It's terrible. I understand. It's not fun to say, but it is what I believe. And it's a very disappointing answer because people, as always, being who we are with our short attention spans, living in a TikTok world, we want things now. And to hear that it would take one entire uh, process of going from being born to becoming an adult to recover is definitely a depressing thing to recognize. 